What's up guys, it's Salvaje and we're back at it again with another video. So if you're watching this on October 4th, it means that you're watching this, my friends, on the day of my birthday. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you for the birthday wishes. Uh, you guys can, of course, uh, give me a birthday present by dropping the video a like, of course. But anyways, um, today I want to make a Boruto anime type discussion video because I haven't made one of these in a while. And I just want to take the time to discuss the Boruto anime with you guys. I really really like and enjoy the Boruto anime, but there is just one problem that I have with it that I of course want to share with you guys. By no means I am saying that the Boruto anime is bad and that I don't enjoy it because of this problem, but I'm just saying the Boruto anime could be better and it could be more amazing. So a lot of people have been saying that, you know, Boruto is nothing compared to Naruto and Naruto Shippuden and that is one of the biggest reasons why I believe that a lot of people just don't enjoy the Boruto anime. They're putting Naruto's expectations, you know, Naruto and Naruto Shippuden's expectations into the Boruto anime. But the thing is, guys, that is why I like the Boruto anime in the first place. Because the Boruto anime is basically the ninja world starting from scratch, starting from zero. I don't really put the expectations of Naruto and Naruto Shippuden into Boruto because I know that Boruto is its own standalone anime. Sure, it's the next generation of Naruto, but what I'm trying to say is that at the beginning of Naruto, Naruto couldn't master the Ninetales power. In fact, it almost took him the entire series for him to be able to actually use uh, you know, the Ninetales power to its fullest extent. And that is what I like about Boruto. You know, things are just very, very slow right now, but on top of all that, you know, it's it's enjoyable. Like, it's not bad, it's not good, but that's the thing, right? It's not great. And that is why I just want to, you know, speak with you guys and just discuss with you guys on why I don't really, you know, enjoy this specific aspect of the Boruto anime and why I think that the Boruto anime can actually be better. So, I just want to say that everybody has different preferences and likings when it comes down to anime. So, what I like and dislike about an anime might be, of course, something completely different for you. What I look forward to in an anime might also be completely different to what you look forward to. I just want to say that before I start up my discussion. So anyways, with that said, let's get right into it. I think one of the biggest problems that the Boruto anime has, at least at the moment, is that the Boruto anime just doesn't really have any conflict right now. And I'm talking about, like, character changing conflict. I'm talking about, you know, pain defeated Jiraiya, so Naruto is going through some, you know, character changing conflict, and now he has to evolve as a character, you know, he has to master the sage mode so that he can defeat pain. You know, I'm talking uh, like, you know, conflict as in everybody thinks Saitama is a fraud. So Saitama has to go out of his way to be the best hero that he can be. You see, guys, one of the main reasons why I watch anime, it's because of the conflict that the animes have. One of the main reasons why I watch anime is because I want to see how the main character overcomes that conflict. And I also want to see the rewards of that main character um, you know, the rewards of the main character overcoming his conflict. Like, for example, the conflict in the pain arc in Naruto was Naruto needed to master Sage Mode, okay? The rewards of the conflict was Mar Naruto mastered Sage Mode and was able to defeat pain badly. <laughs> I love that fight, it's amazing. But anyways, the point is, guys, that is why I watch anime. You know, that is why I really like anime. When I watched the Naruto series, I didn't watch Naruto because I wanted Naruto to become the Hokage. Like, I'm 21 years old, okay? Like, I, I already know that the protagonist is always going to achieve his goal. Like, come on, are, are you kidding me? Like, do you really think I'm watching anime because, you know, I want Ichigo to save Rukia? I know he's going to save Rukia, you know? I, I, I know, like, that that's just there as... You know, I guess you could say like a side bonus. Okay, the real reason why I watch Bleach, the real reason why I watch Naruto is because I wanted Ichigo to overcome the conflict and I wanted to see how powerful he was going to get through it. You know, when Ichigo mastered his Bankai, I wasn't saying, yeah, go save Rukia. I was saying, oh my god, the rewards of the conflict are so amazing. Look at that Bankai. Look how awesome. Look how cool Ichigo looks. I mean, guys, think about it. Like, really, really think about it. When you are watching Naruto, when Naruto was fighting Madara, or when Guy was fighting Madara, like, were you thinking, oh my god, this Guy versus Madara fight is amazing, I can't wait for Naruto to become the Hokage. Or, were you thinking, oh man, like, this, this, uh, you know, Guy and Madara fight is great, you know, the conflict is that, you know, 
uh, Guy needs to defeat Madara because if Guy doesn't defeat Madara, well, Madara is going to end the world in a way. And, uh, you know, the rewards of the conflict is that Guy, you know, is using the eight gates and he's being super OP and he's being super powerful. Okay. Anyways, guys, I'm pretty sure you understand what I mean by now. Okay. But yeah, that is, in my opinion, what I believe to be the only bad thing about the Boruto anime right now. You know, it just doesn't have any conflict. Like, characters aren't evolving, characters aren't changing greatly. And yes, I understand that the anime just started. We're only 25 episodes in, and I have to say that even though this is my problem with the Boruto anime, it doesn't mean that I don't like the anime. It doesn't mean that I don't enjoy the anime. I'm just saying that this anime would be a great anime. This anime would be amazing if there was some conflict in it. Okay? If there was some conflict that would you know, push Boruto past his limits to, you know, for him to master a new power or, or his, you know, the power of his eye. If there was a conflict that would force Boruto and his friends to train harder and, you know, overcome the obstacles that are going to be coming into the Hidden Leaf Village. Now, of course, just in case, uh, you know, you guys don't really keep up with a lot of Boruto news, from what I've heard, there's like uh, the Akatsuki of Boruto arc that's going to be like coming soon. I hope we get that arc soon because quite honestly, guys, if we don't get uh, a pretty good arc after the Land of the Waves arc that we have right now, I'm just going to start slowly losing interest in Boruto, guys. And um, I'm going to be pretty honest with you guys. If I'm just losing interest in the Boruto anime, I'm just not going to be doing the reviews because I'm not going to do like an episode review on an episode that was basically a slice of life episode. Like, I'm getting really tired of doing those. I enjoyed the Sarada arc, but this Land of Waves arc, like, you know, it's just, like, a filler in a way. It's just, like, a side episode. And again, you know, I just want to say, I really, really enjoy the current arc that we have right now, the Land of Waves. It's pretty cool. You know, we're learning more about other villages. I like that. But the point is, I'm saying that, you know, this anime, Boruto, would be so great if there was like a major conflict that actually affected all of the villages you know if boruto had to you know overcome some obstacles and if boruto had to grow and you know get some new powers and all anyways that's pretty much it for me if you guys enjoyed the video you know drop it a like subscribe for more videos uh from me uh what do you guys think it's holding the boruto anime back let me know in the comment sections below and i'll be seeing you guys in the next one